Yo, what's up, you guys? Welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys the best drop spot in Chapter 5, Season 3 that you are going to get guaranteed wins from. Just watch. Alrighty, you guys, in my very professional, very humble, very Fortnite pro mind and feeling, this has to be the best drop spot over here. It's just this little beach side, but there are some crazy perks dropping here, guys, and you're going to want to know what they are. So just stay tuned. I'm going to show you in a sec why this is the best drop spot in the entire game. Alright guys, so the first thing you'll notice when we get here, let's get a chest count up on the screen, guys. I'm gonna count every single chest we open. One. Two. Already got two Nuka Colas. Get one popped. Grab some consumables. There's our first ammo crate. Can't fire here to play zone. If you ever have to. Three. Another consumable box. Go ahead and just pop these to get to full. We're almost full. Flowberry. Another chest. Another consumable box. Another ammo crate. And above us, we got one more chest. Alrighty, good stuff, you guys. Let's go ahead and get this off. Get full HP. Alrighty, but first off, let me go ahead and start talking about the perks of Blender. All of these barrels. One, two, three, four, five, six. That is six barrels every single game, you guys. That is just OP. Next thing we got, launch pad guaranteed every single game. So you got a free rotate from this place. And the other thing that's amazing about landing here, you guys, is look at all the brick down here. There's a couple trees that spawn around you. Some brick. And if you ever need that launch pad, like I said, you can escape. But I'm about to show you guys what's even better than that launch pad. Guys, that's not even the most amount of chests that can spawn here, by the way, you guys. You can all, you can get way more chests here, because chests sometimes spawn in the sand over here, and you can pickaxe them out. But look at that, you guys. We've already got some pretty good mats from breaking all this brick that's on the beach here. Oh my gosh, guys. We are almost max brick from landing here. We're going to go over here, hit this a couple times. We'll be max brick. Perfect. Max wood. And guys, look at that. We have 5579 mats so far. That is insane. You can farm those umbrellas for a little bit of metal, and you can always get those barrels over there for some metal also. But we're not going to worry too hard with our metal. I'm going to go ahead and show you guys the rest of the perks about this place. Oh, also, go ahead and put this on the counter. That is another ammo box. Here's one another. Put that on the counter. And there's a third. Or not third, whatever number that is. Alright guys, so the next cool thing about this drop spot is it comes with two cars. So... You always get a guaranteed tanky car like this, and you always get one of these fast cars. I recommend taking the fast cars, because it's easier to switch back and forth from the seats, you guys. That way you can get the most uh, use out of your car, and you don't have to switch through all those seats. The next thing you're going to do is you're going to grab this. You're going to come up here, and you're going to see there's one of the stations up here. Every game, there's a guaranteed two boxes that spawn up here. So we're going to go grab those in just a sec. Farm that plane for a little bit of metal. Perfect. We just got a purple SMG. Let's go. We're going to go ahead and head up here. And if you look at this, guys, we got a spiked bumper and bulletproof tires. And so if you guys didn't already know how these things work, pretty much you can try over and over again. So, like, I could grab those, wait for them to spawn back in, and then it give me something different every single time, guys. So the faster you do that, if zone's not already on you, we could get some more stuff. But for now, this is the job for me. I'm liking it. Now, all I got to do is go to destroy the rest of this lobby. So that right there, guys, is why that is my favorite spot to land this season. But if you did not find the power-ups you needed, and say they go in zone like they just did, and you don't want them to load, for example, you can head over to this other one that is literally... I'm going to show you guys this. Watch. Wait, ready? If you go on the map, this is literally only 348 meters, and you have a car to get over. So now i got a cow catcher and a grenade launcher. Like, that is way better. And at most of these drops, you guys, there's always these cars you can farm, and these give a decent amount of metal. And here you can grab some more chests and stuff. Having these two places to get car attachments is really OP because having a car this game is obviously really important. So we're going to go ahead and get a little bit of metal, keep on farming it up, and we're going to go find some people now. Guys, make sure you're always getting these little nitro things because they do really make all the difference. You go so fast with these, you guys. Let's start looking for some people to take down, though. I'm going to change the off-road tires. I do like these a little more. Looks like there's a medallion up in front of us. We're going to have to be careful here, you guys, because I don't exactly want to fight all these medallions, but we'll see if we can do anything about them. I'm just going to hop out and take these guys out. Taking out one. I'm 
Let me find some gloves here in a sec, guys. Let's see if we can get our car. Come here, ma! And there we go, guys. Two of those on the board to start the game off. How much metal do you have? Ooh, had some decent metal. Not too bad. There's a little more. And we are almost cap matched now. Perfect. Alrighty, guys. So now, since we are here, this is pretty a good spot to show up to. We can go ahead and get a cow catcher if we don't already have one. And there's a little heel right here. So we're going to go and hop on this. Get our car back up to full. And we can hit the road. Obviously, guys, if you come desert side, there are so many cactuses you can get and stuff. So... Oh, that's really helpful. I definitely recommend coming over here if you ever need heals, but for now, we are looking pretty good. And just a tip, you guys, throughout this season, try and learn where all the repair kits are and stuff, all the cactus are, so you know where to go whenever you need that kind of stuff. Because for me, I've learned out, I've learned where most of these repair stations are, where most of the actual repair boxes are, and it's really helped me come far in this game and rank up a whole lot already. We're going to go ahead and attack this guy. Hit him up. Gotta reload real quick. Ouch. Okay guys, we just took him out. Gotta make sure his car doesn't destroy me here. We're actually gonna go grab my car. We're just going to leave for a sec, guys, because we don't need to fight this right now. We need to be in our car. We're driving towards a medallion. We're going to try to avoid that to the best of our ability. We're just going to vibe, though. We're going to vibe it. Looks like this guy really wants to be dead, so we're going to have to do our best to avoid him here. Please fight that guy that's back there, medallion. It okay, looks like he's fighting him back there. See guys, for example, I knew that I knew that repair was right there, so I had to go get it, and that just helped me repair my car for the better. That was perfect, you guys. There's a whole lot going on right now, guys, but we are living. We got three kills on the board. Things are going pretty good. Well, let's see if we can hit the other side of the map, kind of. We're gonna go right side to avoid the medallion. Here we go. I just heard someone over here. Dead. Taking out. Let's go. All right, four kills on the board. What does this guy have? Nothing crazy. Alrighty, let's see. I heard some shots off to my right. Let's head towards those. Alright, I see some old builds over here. Oh, that's the medallion. We're gonna hit this nitro. Let's just avoid that for the moment. Yeah, they're duking it out over there. We're gonna let them do their thing, man. And if you guys didn't already know, Fuel this game is not really important anymore. Like in the past, if you boosted with your car, you had to fuel it up, but now you really just drive around, man. Pew, pew, pew. Taking out. Let's let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Now, personally, guys, I do prefer the turret. So if you can find a turret somewhere here, got a little repair station. Nitro will hit that real quick. I know there's a little gas station over here. Like I said, learning where all these things are is really important. Looks like we got another one of those. Oh, jeez Louise. Not what I meant to do, you guys. Not what I meant to do at all. That's a good example of Nitro just absolutely killing me. And now my car's dead. Well, I guess I'm gonna trade cars, you guys, because I just ruined that one. Actually, I'll probably take it to a repair station. It'll be worth it. Just a little further, you guys. And then we are going to try and save our heals. We're going to try and get some big pots instead. Here's some shots. We need to heal our car fast. I'm just going to leave my car here. I'm going to go look at these kids. Nice. Taking them out, boys. Alrighty, this guy had some heals for me. That's perfect. We'll go to take advantage of that. And I see you see a cactus over to my left right here. We'll go hit that to finish off our health. And we ought to be back on the road. Two hundred man, holy. 
Alrighty boys, we're actually going on a rampage right now. We're getting quite a few kills. Let's get our big pot off. Look at that, we got the 888 on the top board right now. I'm gonna park my car right here. What I'll do, you guys, I'm gonna box it up if I can. And with that, my car is safe. I'm gonna refarm my brick, and we are good. Now, truthfully, guys, as long as we have gloves in this end game, we ought to win this thing. But we're gonna have to play this safe because it does seem like there's some medallion sweats in here. One guy's two of them, one guy's one of them. They're all the way over there, though. I ought to be safe in this corner of the map and zone, so we're just gonna chill here. While we're perched up here in the box, I want to go ahead and ask you guys, could you please like and subscribe? Especially subscribe, because we are almost at 600 subs, you guys. We only have, I'm pretty sure it is, uh, 51 subscribers left. So we hit 600 subscribers, and 600 subscribers, I will be giving away 1,000 V-Bucks to three of you lucky guys that are subscribed. So please do that. I'm really hyped for that. And if we can hit 1,000 subs before summer ends, you guys, I will give away... 10,000 V-Bucks to either 10 different people or one lucky person. You guys let me know what you want to do. But if we get 1,000 subscribers before the end of summer, guys, before I go back into school, three months from now, I will be giving away a whole lot of V-Bucks. So if you guys want that, let me know down in the comments and let me know if you subscribed. All right, guys, we're going to grab our car. The zone pulled pretty far from us, so we're going to start heading that way. Top six, though. Eight eliminations. Run over this box just to make sure there's no one in it. I'm gonna go check out what this fight is over here, because I think this might be a non-medallion team. You know what I'll do here, guys? I'm gonna take this guy out, boys. I'm gonna try and save my car just for a sec, you guys, because I don't want it to go down just yet. Bad rain, bad rain, terrible rain. Oh god. Guys, I am going to go down there, but those guys were just abusing me with this, so that's how I'm going to go down. There's also a guy up here bowing, of course. That is, that is just too terrific. But that, in my opinion, guys, is the best landing spot for this season. You guys should definitely try it out. It's a great spot for FTS. Very uncontested, usually. But anyway, guys, that is it for the video. Thank you all for watching. If you made it this far, let me know down in the comments by putting a laughing emoji with quotations around it. Thank you all for watching. See you in the next one. Peace.